Well, since my previous video got uh, clipped off on the sides, I thought I'd go ahead and video one more time here. Um, so I haven't turned on the car yet, but what happens is usually when you turn the, the key is it'll show those lights and then it'll go on. So you have volume control, on and off, AM, FM, EQ, uh, all sorts of settings for the radio, uh, which is pretty cool. Let me turn on the light up here so you can see. There's the soft touch buttons up here. Um, and so you have climate. You've got a summary page, which is just general splash page. You have gauges, which is all the readings. Uh, trip computer, which is pretty cool. Trip monitor, all that cool stuff. Uh, clock, diagnostic, so you can set your clock. You can set the brightness. I usually keep it all mostly up, just so it's easier to see. You can set it by, I think it's touching sides or something. Something I don't remember. Um, oh, darkness required to set. So that's why it does that. Okay. Um, diagnostic. Tells you everything's like okay. So on and so forth. Uh, so it's pretty cool. And of course here we have the, the actual gauges themselves. Like I said, you can go to metric. And you can set the trip odometer. I usually reset this when I get gas. Gauges, of course, all your wipers, all that good stuff here. Uh, let me open the door here. So that very nice and clean, very nice and clean. And then the window buttons. So, the window works very well. I wouldn't use the passenger side that much if you can avoid it. It works, but it's kind of slow. Well, a little bit. I'd just be careful. Um, and then down here you have your fuel access, your glove box, all that. So like the glove box. Which is cool. Um, the mirrors here, which is cool. Um, you have your map lights in the mirror. It warns you literally of everything. We'll go ahead outside the car now. Bear in mind, of course, one of the headlights burned out as I was testing it, so I'll get a new one tomorrow. But what's really cool, I think, about this car is the really cool back lights. They literally go all the way across, which is pretty cool. Um, but as you can hear, it's running very, very well. Very quiet. Um, you can stick your hand on the hood and you can't even barely feel it running, which is pretty cool. And of course, the headlights work nicely. Ooh. And this still works too, which is really cool. The little light for the key, so you don't scratch the car. You put the key in to open the door. Um, the interior, of course, very, very nice. Looks almost like new. Like I said, I'm waiting to get a sun visor and a couple of the plastic pieces. I'm hoping eventually to find a new door panel for you because uh, it's got sun damaged here. Uh, through the years, but you know, it looks pretty decent. But it's pretty cool. Um, it seems to be running pretty good. Actually, excellent, I should say. And uh, like I said, the AC. Oh, you can also on the touch screen, if you don't want to see an alert, you just press return. Kind of like a computer.
episode four. And of course, your wipers, which all work great. Headlight, everything. So this is the 88 Buick Riata.